Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. So, we have all of these stamping plates to get through today. So, I would advise, get a snack, get a drink, and uh, yep, let me get sorted and we'll get started. Okay, I'm all set up now. They are mostly Nicole Diary. This is the only brand that is different. So, this is XMQ038. And as you can see, it is Adam's Family. So you've got all of the um, characters on here. Um, you have Wednesday, um, Gomez, Morticia. You do have a couple of different. You have a couple of um, Jack on here from Nightmare Before Christmas. Look at this butterfly. That is so cool. So yeah. So I really wanted to get this plate because I thought it was really cool. And I don't have an Anne's family plate. And I saw this and I thought. Oh, that is actually really, really cool. I really, really liked this one. So, yeah. Um. Oh, and these are all from AliExpress, by the way. So, yeah. So, I picked up that one because I thought it was really, really cool. I like it as well because it's got the backing on. So, it makes it a lot safer. So, let's start with the Nicole Diary. So, first up, we have S05. And this is autumn, an autumn one. So you have lots of different leaves on here and they're all individual images, which is what I like. I do like that, it makes it a lot easier. So you can do some layering. Let me turn it back this way just so you can have another look. I do like um, the leaf plates like this because then you can, you know, sort of layer them and, you know, put different ones on the, on the same nail, which makes it a lot easier. So, yep, yeah, so I've got that one. And I also got S09. Um, I'm thinking I've got this one um, as a dupe from uh, Timu. If I have, I will probably put that into a giveaway or something like that. Um, I'm pretty sure I ordered two of these by accident. I know I ordered two of the plates um, twice by accident. So they will go into friend mail or sell them or whatever but anyway this is s09 and this is like you know like space one which is really really cool makes it so much easier i'd never be able to draw all of these look at this hand image that's so cool and you have lots of different planets on there and i like that the images aren't huge but yeah i thought it was really really cool so that is that one there and I also ordered S14. So this is what it looks like this way. And then I will go this way just so you can see. My phone's really annoying me. It's right in the way. But anyway, on this one, we have some leaves, um, some foliage, animal print, which is really, really cool. And um, yeah, there's some flowers on here as well. We also have, look, we have a little squirrel down here. How cool is that? So that would be perfect for autumn as well. So that is that one there. And that is S14. This one is S19. So if I show you this way, just so you can get a little bit of a look at it. Let me move this light a little bit more. Then I might be able to tilt it out of the camera view. So we have a couple of imaging, uh, layering images on this one, which is really, really cool. I like that as well. Most of them are layering. So again, we have some leaves. You don't have to use the complete layers. You can just use just the first layer or whichever layer you want, which is also very handy. We have a couple of layering flowers, leaves. And we also have this layering sunflower down here, which is really, really cool. And this small little image down here as well. So I really, really like this. We have some dandelions on there as well. So that is S19. And we have uh, S28, which this is more of your sort of like Halloween gothic -y one. I absolutely love this one. I've wanted this one for a while. So on this one, obviously, we have hearts and cobwebs, which is really, really cool. And I really like that some of these you can sort of like layer if you wanted to. I love these. These are so cool. I cannot wait to use this. I think I'm going to have to do another gothic set and a Halloween set using this. So that is it again there. 
super super cool as i said this is going to be a longer video because i have quite a few to get through so next up we have s29 and i thought this one was really really cool i don't have anything else like it i think i have one that might be a bit similar i think that's a beauty big bang one but i don't have a nicole diary one so as you can see this is butterflies and i just thought it was really cool i really like the images on here they're very very cool a lot of detail really like them and of course they're like flames and then you have your long flame image down here how cool is that they're so cool i think they are awesome i love them so again that is s29 give me one second so next up we have s31 which is this one which is sort of like your uh, knitted print which is going to be so cool i'm really excited to use this with the uh she modern sticky stamp polish it's going to be so cool really really cool so you have all your different kind of knit patterns on here i think this is so cool really really cool i really really like this plate you have a little bow heart you have all sorts of different ones on here which I think is really cool, especially if you don't want to do, you know, freehand or embossed look. You can stamp it so it's not, you know, it's not raised on the nail. So, yeah, so I really, really like that. And again, that is S31. Loving it, loving it. So that is all for that shape plate. So we're going to go move on to the normal size plates. And this is uh, two, 208. I'm thinking I may already have this one because I recognise this image here, but I don't know. If I have, it will go somewhere. <laughs> so this one is a load of dragons, which is super, super cool. I love it. I really like this moon here. That's really cool. I like this like side one here. So you can get really, really creative. And you also have like... Um, the uh, print of them on this side as well which i think is really cool you could really mix and match and we have these separate clouds over here so yeah you could get really really creative with that i love it it's so cool i really really like it really like it. i think it's a really cool plate um and then next up we have uh 213 now i know i do have a dupe of this this is um also on timu as well so obviously timu you've got dupes of uh, branded plates so yeah if you're like me and you're a collector of stamping plates just be careful that you're not buying dupes of stuff so i kn i knew that i'd already got this because of certain images on it um so yeah so i know i have a dupe of this one and i also have a second one of that dupe if that makes sense so basically i've got three one nickel diary and two from demu i must have really liked this plate is all i can say <laughs> so this is 213 and as you can see there's a whole bunch of all different stuff on here uh we have a dagger we have hearts um some writing we have bugs uh skeletons snakes cross we have ace of spades on here we have this broken glass a pill moon just jam-packed with all different stuff i think this plate is probably a must-have if, if you do a lot of sort of like different sets and things like that i think this plate would be really really handy because you have a bit of everything on this so yeah i think this one would definitely be handy and i definitely think it's a must-have as well so yeah so that is 213 and we have 293 which again is another flame plate so as you can see you've got these all these single images up here which is really really cool pretty sure i have some of these images on some other plates but um yeah i really wanted it anyway because i haven't got any nicole diary stuff for a while so you have two of these long ones down here you have this one then you have your separate sort of flames up there, flame hearts and that. So that's really cool. I like that one as well. And then we have uh, $2.99. I absolutely love this play. I loved it that much that so I brought two of them by accident. So yeah, so I do have a deep with this one, but I think it's so pretty. It's really, really pretty. It's right up my street. I love it. It's so pretty. Such a pretty, pretty plate. You've got flowers, you've got butterflies, bows. Oh, it's just such a pretty plate. 
I think it's really, really pretty. Can you tell I like it? <laughs> so yeah, so that is uh, $2.99. And then we have uh, $3.04. So this is, as you can tell, it's a whole bunch of roses. And we have these bits around the outside as well. We have a couple of layering ones. We have going up in three different sizes. We have some with leaves, some with just buds. These fancy hearts down here as well. Another beautiful, beautiful plate. I really, really like this one. I think it's really pretty. So that is 304. And then moving on to the like rectangular size ones. So this is um, X006. So I will show you like that just so you can get an idea of what it looks like. So this one again is a load of flowers and it's a bit more abstract. But I really, really like it. I think it's really nice. Different size images as well. Some going one way, some going another. And you've got some circles and dots and things. I think it's a really, really nice plate. So that is X006. And then next up we have X007. So this is what the full view looks like. So again, it's a halloween -y plate. I absolutely love it. Is it too early to do Halloween? <laughs> I really want to do them. I really want to show them. Is it? Oh, I don't know. But anyway, on this you have a whole bunch of all different stuff. You have candles, moons, uh, pentagrams, snakes, witches hat, potion bottles. Just a whole bunch of all different stuff. I really, really like it. You have a key down here. You have a cat with like a, a spell book. You have a crow, bats. I just love it right up my street. I love it. And again, that is X007. We're getting through these quite quick, actually. Next up, we have S009. And again, it's sort of like your abstracty one, which is really, really nice. I do like these plates. So again, it's a bunch of flowers. I like these ones down here as well. Really, really nice plate. I do really like it. This would be really good for reverse stamping as well. So I really like this one. So again, that is X009. Very, very nice plate. I've no idea where I'm going to put these. I don't know. Next up is uh, X013. So again, you have a whole bunch of like flowers. Sorry, my back's really hurting. Um, yep, different flowers, some foliage, and we have these like bits that you can put behind them and layer them, layer them on top, which is really handy. So yeah, I really like this one as well. So again, that is uh, X013. And there you go. I will post some pictures at the end just in case I'm going a bit too fast. So we have X014 and this is another beautiful plate. I really like this. I cannot wait to use these. So again, this is, you know, sort of like you've got some hearts and dots, different shapes. So you have some foliage, moon, hearts. It's a really, really nice plate. I really like it. Look at this. This is cool. And you have these ones down here and you also have these that are here. So you have a star one and a heart one, which is really, really nice. Really, really like this plate. So again, that is X014. So next up we have uh, X015. And that's what the full view looks like. And then I will bring it closer up. So this is a whole bunch of, as you can see, sort of tropical leaves, which is really handy for, you know, the summer. The summer's coming up very soon. So this would be a handy one to have. I think if you have this one, I don't think you'd need any more. Not with the leaves on anyway. So yeah, so it's a bit sort of abstract, but I think it's really, really cool. So that is X15. Not really, not really much I can say about that one. So this is X18. So again, we have some flowers and some snakes. 
so let me bring it up just so you can have a closer look so yeah as i said snakes and some all different flowers look how intricate that is i mean you wouldn't be able to draw that so yeah we have some butterflies with some snakes as well really really nice play i think it's really nice and you've got these full images down here as well which is nice i like that they've sort of like done a mix of negative space and uh, positive space as well which i think is really really nice so yeah so that is that one there so that is x018 two more to go so we have uh x019 so as you can see this has got animal print and we have some leaves and a couple of flowers so these are the animal print at the top and then we have like our abstracty stuff and then we have our leaves and flowers down here i just think this one was really cool as well and again, I think it's a handy one to have. If you just want to sort of like limit your collection, you could get something like this that's got three different sort of like things on it that you could use for three different themes. So yeah, I thought that one was, was pretty cool, pretty handy to have. So that is X019. And we all know I'm a collector of plates. I've got so many plates. I think I must have about 2,000 now. It's got to be easy which is just terrible but i can't help myself i have a serious problem so this is nicole diary x20 so this is the last one so again we have some flowers and some animal print you have them together and you have some abstracty lines or you can do the single images at the top which is really really cool so this, again this would be perfect for doing reverse stamping or doing a funky background i just think it's really really cool so that is x020 so that is it that is all of them i don't even know how many is here i don't know but i think i have a serious problem so yeah um let me know any thoughts you have down below and if you want any links just let me know and i will try and find them for you because there will be too many links for me to put in the description box. Um, so yeah, just let me know any thoughts you have and I will crack on and use these. If there is a particular plate, there is so many, but if there is a particular couple of plates you want me to use first, let me know and I can get that sorted. Um, if not, I will just work my way through them. However, um, maybe I would do like, I don't know, maybe a wheel thing and select a couple of numbers and, and do a set like that or something like that anyway but yeah if you have any ideas just let me know down below and please give this video a big thumbs up because i'm not getting my thumbs up at all so i don't know if you're liking what i'm doing or not liking what i'm doing i'm getting so many views but nobody's clicking the thumbs up button and it is it's really important for everybody who does youtube videos it's really important that you just click either the like or the dislike it doesn't matter it's still an interaction so we can gauge sort of what you're liking and what you're not liking so it helps kind of it helps us creators so much so yeah so if you don't want to leave me a comment just give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down it doesn't matter at least then i can gauge what you like and uh, yeah if you don't want to leave a comment or you just want to leave me just a couple of purple hearts or something i don't mind but anyway that's enough of my ramblings for today don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up again and uh yeah if you're not subscribed please subscribe and yep i will get using these very very soon well thank you so much for watching and hopefully i will see you in the next one until then take care bye